Hi, my name is James with Animals in the Attic Restaurant Division. Even if you don't think you have a rodent problem in your restaurant, every restaurant owner should follow these simple steps. The notorious back door, often left propped open during cigarette breaks and taking trash out. It's a critical point for a restaurant. You've got to keep that door closed in between deliveries and never have it propped open. If you have found this information helpful, click on the like button below. Dry storage areas, super common problem with rodents. You're storing rice, flour, sugar, oils, all kinds of containers that they can chew through and get great food sources. In fact, some of their favorite food sources. Take a look at what's in your dry storage and make sure you don't have grains and pastas and other edible things in cardboard boxes or easily accessible containers. Try a Cambro or a Lexan with a lid to prevent them to getting into your foods. It'll be safer for your customers and save you money. You have rats in your restaurant. Your go-to guy is the local pest control company. He's a friend of yours even. But the thing is, they don't get rid of rodents. They have a process where they manage rodents, which means now you've probably got bait boxes outside of your restaurant letting everyone know that you have a rodent problem. Pest control companies are not designed to solve your problem. They're designed to manage your problem. It's how they make money. You need to call a nuisance wildlife removal specialist. Your building needs to be animal proofed and those animals need to be trapped in snap traps where they can be carried out of your restaurant so you know where they're at. If you have or think you have a rodent problem in your restaurant, give us a call here at Animals in the Attic Restaurant Division. We will discreetly help you as quickly and professionally as we can.